Hi everyone, today we're going to be checking out all the loose cars I got at the convention. And then there's all the other stuff, but yeah, let's check out the loose cars first, because I'm eager to use this new turntable. Uh, the first car I got was this Range Rover. I got it for free. Um, I was like, how much is this? Because I like the car, and the guy just let me keep it. So yeah, that's a very nice car. It's got good details, that's why I like it. And then I got this and the next two in a three for one deal because I liked this one. Um, so I just had to pick out two more. Uh, that one's in not great condition and neither is this one, but they're still cool. I don't like the way that the front wheel gap is on this one, so that kind of sucks. It's got like a little bit of like squish to it though. That might be intentional or that might just be the axles bending. Then I got this car too, arguably in the best condition out of all of them. Well, definitely in the best condition, there's only like one paint scratch. Next I got this Cadillac for 50 cents. Uh, no rear details obviously, and there are front details which is nice, although the Cadillac lo logo is off center, which is annoying, but oh well. Then I got this El Camino, it's a matchbox for 50 cents too. So, you know, I get all the El Caminos for my neighbor that aren't like, you know, $100 or some crazy amount. Um, so that one's pretty cool. Uh, this Oscar Mayer Wienermobile was $2.50. There was four cars and the guy wanted 10 or 20 bucks, so I offered him 10 and he said yes. Most of them are premiums, but I just thought this one was cool, so I got it with them. Let's see. This purple car, I'm not sure what it is. Let's see, it doesn't say on the bottom, but I got it for 50 cents also. It looks kind of like a Saline S7, which I got a couple of. Uh, these two were also 50 cents. Saline S7s. There's a silver one, and then here's a white one. So, for 50 cents, they're nice. And then that's, this Jaguar was 50 cents. Jaguar F-Type, I think. And this one's pretty cool. I'm glad I got this one. Uh, Lamborghini Urus for 50 cents. I got that one because I like like the Lamborghinis and stuff. And then this one, the uh, Pex Peak Toyota, something or other, um, for 50 cents also. So pretty nice. And then I got this black car for 50 cents. What is it? Buick Rivera or something? I can't tell. But 50 cents can't really go too wrong. Uh, I got this van for 50 cents because I had it as a kid. And I remember it. So I was just like, oh, that's neat. So I could, I picked it up. Got this Tadega for 50 cents. This thing's pretty cool. I like this quite a bit. And then I got this Porsche for 50 cents. Very nice blue on that one. And then got this Civic for a dollar. Gonna customize it, probably. And then Another Civic, I just found this at Harman's, so I'll just let you see it for a sec. It's the Civic SI, you probably all know it well. And then, this is pretty cool. This came in a little box. It was a throw-in. Castrol funny car. Um, this one was just cool. I like 
the ones that you can display like this. It's got a purple base, cool deco. Just a very cool car. Jolly Ranchers, the top is pretty cool too. This. Um, but yeah, that one's pretty cool. And then before we get into the premium stuff, I do want to mention these customs are pretty cool. Um, I can't remember this is who did them, they threw them in. Yeah, I got them at the Atlanta convention. I got a couple of those Peeps one and then this Porsche. It's pretty cool. Um, now let's get into some of the premium stuff. We'll start off with all these motorhomes. The first one is a treasure hunt. I paid five bucks for it. I'm really liking these motorhomes, so I got a whole bunch of them. Um, so this is the treasure hunt. Obviously, you can see the TH there. It's got the three wheels. And then from the same guy, I got a really nice guy, by the way. I got this one for $3. Doctor Strange. Um, these motorhomes are good not only because they look cool, but also they're like, for the price of two of them, you can get three sets of wheels. Because the, you know, the back wheels. There's two of them. And then I got this for, I can't remember, but it was probably 50 cents. Because it's all beat up. But if I see a, you know, a good condition in one of these, I'll definitely get it because it... I obviously I would rather have the good condition one. This one was very cool. This one was 50 cents. This is a really good buy for 50 cents. It's got the fancy wheels. It's got all the stickers. The only problem is it sits kind of funky. Like the wheels are all caught up or something. I think the axle isn't long enough. Nope, there we go. I think it's just stuck or something. There we go. That yeah, was better. Um, but this one is very cool. I really like the deco on this one quite a bit see how it like sits weird um but for 50 cents you mean i mean not bad and it's gonna be you're gonna be able to see it like this when i display it so and then next we got honda odyssey for i can't remember i think it was like three bucks or something um so that one's pretty nice that one is one that i've been after for quite a while And then we've got this 4GT. I got it for 5 bucks. This is also one that I've been after for a while. The Forza. Forza one. And it's pretty nice. It's got, obviously, the rubber wheels. Uh, rear details. Front details. Nice 4GT. And then I got this Ferrari, which is very nice. For 5 bucks. I like these premium Ferraris, but I don't usually get them because they're usually 80 bucks. But $5 is, you know, a really, really good price. Um, so that's pretty nice. I quite like that one, front rear details. Um, and then I got this for $10 because I thought it was a Mustang Boss 302. I can get it out of the case, that is. Um, but luckily... Someone will trade it, trade me the um, Vintage Racing Boss 302 for this, which is nice, so. But I paid 10 bucks for this, and I was like, wow, that's a crazy good deal, because I thought it was the Boss 302. But it sadly is not, but luckily, I will be able to trade it for the gold, or for the yellow Boss 302. And then I'll only need a few more. Um, and then... This one is actually the Boss 302, so this is one that I've been after for a while. It's usually really expensive cartridge, so I'm glad I got it loose for 15. Um, this is a very nice car. I'm very excited to have it. Next is some Johnny Lightnings. This was the same deal as the Oscar Mayer Wiener, Wiener Mobile. This tire is all messed up. There you go. Uh, I really like this bus. 
I've wanted it for a while, and I finally got it. So it's pretty cool. And then two dollars fifty cents also for this. Uh, what is it? Jaguar or something? But it's got an opening hood. Sometimes, so you can see the hood in there, but or the engine in there. But that one's pretty cool. I think it's an Aston Martin. It might not be licensed though, and it just looks like one. Um, but yeah, that one's pretty cool. And then I got this one also in that deal, but we'll talk about that later. And then this Johnny Lightning for fifty cents. That was a really good deal. It's got rubber rubber tires and everything. It looks old. Um, so that one's pretty cool. I like. I just like the way the deco looks. And then dollar for this. Racing Champions went Viper. Uh, that one is... This one's nice for a dollar. Um, but yeah. That one is... I, I don't really like the silver headlights, but... Uh, whatever. And then for cars, for wheels... I got this one as a throw-in. Because... Um, you know, I wanted one of these for a while to put new wheels on. And then, when I got that... Sorry about background noise, it's just going to be there because I don't want to edit the whole thing together. When I got that, I went down the hall and got this for $4 for the wheels. So that one's pretty nice. I think those wheels will go well on here. I've done all the other um, R32s with these wheels. And then I got this one for the wheels, obviously, and the same deal, for the 4 for 10 deal. Um, and then the next, because I got this because I was like, I don't know if I have it. If I do, I'll use it for wheels. If I don't, oh well. I got these two for 5 bucks a piece. Um, so obviously, these wheels are kind of hard to come by. So when I can buy them, I usually do, because they're very nice wheels. Um, and then these were $2.50 a piece for the wheels, obviously. Pretty nice. Um, but yeah, that's all I got for loose cars. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. If it'll focus. Yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.